American steam engine is a reciprocating water displacement gravity engine powered by steam or air. All the power to the crankshaft is caused by gravity. Power is made by pushing water up with air pressure and letting it fall back down or steam pressure. This tank is sealed on top, has a float in it of equal weight to this float that weigh approximately 150 pounds in this engine. The tanks are connected below with a space allow water to flow through from one tank to the other. I pressurize this tank, this float drops, this float rises with power being made on the upward and downward stroke. Due to the re double ratcheting crankshaft system, right now I'm utilizing bicycle hubs, three wheels as the float goes down and up, turns in the same direction. This gravity engine can run on very low air pressure or steam pressure. This engine is fairly inexpensive to build. I have a flywheel on the front of this crankshaft. About seven pound weights on the end. Smooth out the power. There's very low friction between the walls of the float and the tank. This, float, this engine is scalable. It can be built to any size. And it can run on steam or air or other exhaust gases from uh, combustion engines. This is an external combustion engine. It runs off pressure. I'll demonstrate the operation. I'm using a vacuum cleaner fan as my air fuel source. That does some serious work off the air from this fan, which is uh, probably it's very low pressure, maybe a half a pound. It's a centrifugal blower or a vacuum cleaner system. It'll run on a shot vac motor. Got one right there. American steam engine.